it's a, it's a state secret. I wonder when he gets the game for us. And do you know that the crew are interviewed for this role of ma managing and minding and pushing and performing the orchestra? There's a certain criteria. There's athletic standards, there's public relations training you have to do, and an attitude check. I think it's physical, a military physical standards that they have to reach to roll the drum. And look at there, we have some more wonderful cheerleaders leading the band. We have just 393 performers in this band today. This is the largest band we have. It's really exciting. When we get these numbers through, we know that we have these huge bands. It's great. And they're always amazing performers. Everything is in unison. They're synchronized perfectly together. They were the first marching band in the United States to break military ranks in the football field and form the letter P. Let's take a look. they just fantastic such a spectacle and the noise here in the streets just the real thundering boom of the drums and the instruments it's really something Karen isn't it yeah it's the scale and the intensity of them all together the huge big instruments the way they're performing together in unison it's just such a show it's a really big deal for these bands isn't it coming to Ireland many of them save up for years they do fundraising they do all of that to try and get themselves over here yes they there could be, well, there's 300 in this, nearly 400 in this band, there could be a thousand people traveling. So that is an expensive trip. And it would take them about three or four years to fundraise to their alumni, they do fundraising, you know, in college or whatever. So we really thank them for coming all this way because they're really 